Hello guys, in today's video, we are going to present to you the top 5 best thermal monoculars available on the market today. We made this list from our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers. Check out the description to find out their prices and more information. We've included the links in the description below. If you are here for the first time on our channel, please subscribe and hit the bell button for the daily video notification. So without further ado, let's get started. The number one position is dominated by FLIR SCOW TK Handheld Thermal Monocular. For people who mostly do close-up hunting and spotting, the FLIR SCOW TK is a great choice. You can detect animals, including smaller ones like squirrels, from up to 100 years out. Its compact pocket size design makes the SCOW TK easy to carry around. The FLIR SCOW TK Thermal Monocular is ideal for beginners or people looking for an affordable thermal scope for basic hunting and animal spotting. The price is lower than most thermal scopes, especially for a FLIR product, but you should understand what you're getting. For one, the range is decent but limited. You'll be able to detect warm objects up to around 100 years out. In this range, you can make out large animals, and for smaller animals like birds or squirrels, you'll need to be closer to tell which animal it is. The resolution is also on the lower side. The 160 by 120 sensor produces a good quality image, but only at close range. It's one of the reasons why Scout TK's detection range is limited to 100 yards. Beyond this, the image is too fuzzy. What we love most about the Scout TK is its portability. It weighs just 6 ounces and can fit in your pocket. The included lanyard makes it easy to carry it around safely when you are out in the woods. You'll also love the photo and video capability, and you can cycle through multiple color palettes when taking photos or recording videos. To transfer media to another device, the Scout TK comes with a USB cable that you'll also use for charging the scope. The Li-Ion battery gives you about 5 hours of continuous use. The FLIR Scout TK has limited imaging performance overall, which is expected for an entry-level thermal monocular. The resolution, refresh rate and detection range are all on the lower side. And because of the low resolution, the Scout TK lacks any magnification as zooming in would significantly distort image quality. If you're looking for high resolution, high magnification thermal monocular, you can use spotting distant animals, the SCOW TK is not it. While it does have a plenty of limitations, the FLIR SCOW TK is perfect for close to mid-range animal spotting. Beginners will also love its low price and ease of use. If you want to know about the latest price of the FLIR SCOW TK handheld thermal monocular, Check the description box. Moving on to the next, at number 2, a Pulsar Axion Key XM30. The Pulsar Axion Key XM30 is a major step up from the FLIR SCOW TK in almost every aspect, including resolution, magnification, and detection. With a detection range of up to 1300 yards, the XM30 is best for short and long range animal scouting and spotting. Our FLIR SCOW TK is good but isn't much help when trying to scout far away animals. The Pulsar Axion Key has a much longer range, up to 1300 yards, for spotting animals from far out. It also helps that Axion Key has optical and digital zoom, helping you observe animals from a safe distance. Optical or step zoom is 2x and 4x that is supplemented by 4x digital zoom. While zooming, you can engage the PIP or picture-in-picture -picture mode. This lets you magnify your target in a small window at the top of the display while retaining a clear view of the environment. The 320 sensor doesn't have the highest resolution, but it's not too bad. The only time you might find it limiting is when you zoom in too much. The image gets fuzzy. You can still take photos and record videos using the Axion Key XM30 monocular. It has an internal memory of 16GB and the XM30 monocular supports a Stream Vision app. Link the XM30 to your phone via Wi-Fi, then download the free Stream Vision app. You can then use the smartphone as a remote viewfinder, remote control, and video or photo recorder. You can also live stream your adventures via the app. The 3200mAh battery is good for up to 4 hours, so use the included USB cable to recharge it. 
As for construction quality, the Axion Key XM30 is designed to withstand rugged environments while being easy to carry around. It has a lightweight but tough aluminum body and is rated as IPX7 waterproof. The XM30 has a better resolution than the Scout TK, but the XM30 is still limited in terms of image quality. The 320 by 240 resolution proves inadequate when you zoom in too far. You'll find it easier to get closer to your target rather than relying entirely on the zooming. There's also the issue of price. The XM30 is more than three times the price of the Scout TK. If you're looking for a budget thermal scope, this is not it. With its improved optics of rugged and lightweight construction, the live streaming capability, the Axion Key XM30 is well worth the higher price tag, especially for hunters who want to see more than a few hundred years away. If this is your desired product, please check the links in the description below. The number 3 position is held by FLIR Breach PDQ-136 Multipurpose Monocular. The FLIR Breach PDQ-136 is designed primarily for law enforcement, but there's no reason you cannot use it for hunting and animal spotting. The integrated railing allows you to mount it on a helmet for hands-free spotting. FLIR Breach comes ready for helmet mounting. It has an integrated mini rail for attaching it to a helmet. You do not need an adapter or any additional equipment to mount the Fluid Breach monocular. As for the optics, Breach falls in the mid level performance range and is better than beginner thermal scopes, but it has some significant limitations. The 320 by 256 sensor delivers a pretty clear image, provided you are not too far away from the target. The maximum detection range is about 225 years for people and large animals. For smaller animals, you need to be about 100 yards away to get a clear image. Flare Breach has a 1 to 4 times continu continuous digital zoom to get you closer view, but knows that zooming will reduce image quality. One optical feature we love about the Flare Breach is the high refresh rate of 60 Hz. When you're using a helmet mounted scope, you are likely to be moving a lot. The high refresh rate ensures you still get a smooth image when on the move. The FLIR Bridge can take up to a thousand steel images and record up to 2.5 hours of video. Use the included USB cable to transfer media to an external device. With a weight of 7.4 ounces and a compact design, the FLIR Bridge is easy to carry. The FLIR Bridge thermal monocular is not designed for long range observations, and most users reported a useful range of about 200 years, less for smaller animals. Another issue is the price. FLIR Bridge is not ideal for budget minded customers. Better life could be better, and the 90 minute continuous usage is less than most other thermal scopes. What makes the FLIR Bridge good for the law enforcement also makes it great in the woods. The woods. It has excellent optics, lightweight design, and the option to mount it on a helmet. Is this video making value to your search? If yes, please do like, share, and comment. Next at number 4 of Leopold LTO Tracker HD Thermal Viewer. If you like to hunt or spot animals at night, we recommend the Leopold LTO Tracker HD Thermal Monocular. You can also use it during the day, but it shines most in cooler conditions. The LTO Tracker HD easily picks up temperature differences in the environment, allowing you to spot even small animals like rabbits at a significant distance. The Leopold LTO Tracker HD works best in cool night temperatures, that's when it provides the best contrast between your target and the environment. On extra cool nights, the detection range can be as far as 750 yards. Obviously, it's much shorter for small game. You can use the 6x digital zoom to get a closer view of your target. The thermal scopes and zoom generally don't go well together. Beyond 4x, it will be hard to make out any warm objects. We recommend using the zoom feature sparingly and don't go beyond 4x. The 320x240 thermal resolution is not too bad. It provides decent image quality, but be careful not to zoom too much as it reduces image quality. The CR123 battery provides up to 3 hours of continuous use. Note that the battery is non-rechargeable. The Leopold LTO Tracker HD does not have a video or image recording. If you are hoping to keep a record of your adventures, look for another thermal monocular. We've also mentioned the poor image quality when using the digital zoom, especially if you go beyond 4x. The 25 hours refresh rate is a bit slow, so the image can be choppy when trying to follow a moving animal or observe a target while you are on the move. The Leopold LTO Tracker HD has quite a few limitations, 
but for the price, we still think it is a good deal, especially for beginners and anyone looking for an entry-level thermal scope for nighttime hunting. If you've already used any of these products, do let us know through a comment. comment. It will help others to a worthy buy. Finally, at number 5, we have ADN Binox 40 2-8x Thermal Binocular. Most of the hunting binoculars you'll find online are night vision binoculars. They are good for seeing the dark, but won't help you spot animals hiding in thickets. If you're looking for binoculars with thermal, not night vision, technology, we recommend the ADN Binox 40 384 2-8x thermal binoculars. They're pricey but offer the best in class optical performance and you also get a few extras including a built-in laser, rangefinder and video streaming. It is surprisingly hard to find a good pair of thermal binoculars and most use night vision technology which won't help you see through bushes and limited range. If you want high quality binoculars, be ready to spend quite a bit of money. The Eddy and Binox 40 binoculars are pricey but they offer really good optics and some nice extra features. Let's start with the optics. The Bi Binox 40 binoculars feature a 384 by 288 sensor that's good enough to detect animals as far out as 1000 years. The recognition and identification ranges are, however, much shorter at 480 and 300 years. Similar to other thermal optics, you can choose from several color palettes for better target identification. Binox 40 offers 2x two times to 8x times magnification, allowing to zoom in for a closer view. Thanks to the high resolution sensor, you can zoom in quite close before image quality degrades too much. The Binox 40 comes with a built in laser rangefinder to help you calculate the distance to the target. These binoculars also have a built in IR illuminator, and the illuminator is helpful if you or the hunting partners have night vision and need better visibility. Binox 40 offers both video recording and streaming, both at HD resolution. That's all for today. We upload Amazon product review videos in every single day. So don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button for the daily video notifications.